In the sprawling metropolis of modern-day Mexico City, a silent witness to the ancient past lies partially concealed beneath a vast expanse of volcanic rock. Cuicuilco, an ancient Mesoamerican city, once thrived in the Valley of Mexico, its skyline dominated by a unique circular pyramid. Today, much of this once vibrant urban center rests beneath the Pedregal de San Angel, a dramatic landscape formed by the solidified lava flows of the Citla volcano. The story of Cuicuilco is a compelling narrative of rise and fall, of human ingenuity and the overwhelming power of nature, offering a glimpse into the early stages of civilization in the Americas. The origins of Cuicuilco trace back to the early formative period, with evidence suggesting its establishment as an agricultural village around 1400 to 1200 BCE. This early settlement, located on the southern shores of Lake Texcoco, marked the beginnings of a community that would eventually grow into a significant regional power. While some accounts point to a slightly later settlement around 800 BCE, the consistent evidence of very early occupation underscores Cuicuico's status as one of the most ancient sites in the Valley of Mexico. Over the subsequent centuries, the small farming village underwent a transformation, gradually developing into a more complex society with public buildings appearing as early as 1000 to 800 BCE in the form of conical structures with oval bases. This early architectural activity signifies a move towards a more organized and potentially hierarchical community. By the middle formative period 800 to 150 BCE, Quiquilco had experienced substantial growth, evolving into one of the largest and most important ceremonial centers in ancient Mexico. Estimates suggest that its population reached an impressive 20,000 inhabitants, and some even propose figures as high as 40,000, indicating a major urban hub for its time. Supporting this significant population was a sophisticated hydraulic system, a testament to the engineering capabilities of the Cuicuilca people, who skillfully channeled water for irrigation, domestic use, and even for religious spaces. The presence of multiple pyramids, terraces and temples further attest to its importance as a religious and civic center. Evidence of a four-tier settlement hierarchy suggests a well-defined social structure, indicating a complex level of organization and governance within the city. This period marks Cuicuilco's ascent as a dominant force in the Valley of Mexico, laying the groundwork for its unique architectural legacy. The most iconic feature of Cuicuilco is undoubtedly its circular pyramid, a structure that sets it apart from the more common squared pyramids of later Mesoamerican cultures. While precise dimensions vary slightly across different accounts, the main pyramid is consistently described as a large, multi-tiered circular edifice. Some sources indicate a height of 23 meters with five levels, while others suggest dimensions of 85 feet, approximately 26 meters, tall, and 360 feet, approximately 110 meters, wide, dating its construction to the 5th century BCE. Another account describes it as having four tiers with a diameter of 116 meters and a height of 26 meters. Regardless of the exact measurements, the sheer scale and distinctive circular form of the pyramid mark it as a remarkable architectural achievement for its time. Constructed as a series of five superposed structures in the form of truncated cones, the pyramid featured ramps on its eastern and western sides, providing access to the summit. This unique design likely held profound religious and cosmic significance for the Quiquilca people. Its strategic positioning suggests an early attempt to connect religious beliefs with celestial events. Archaeological findings reveal a stone altar at the pyramid's summit, aligned with the sun during the equinox, indicating its astronomical and ritual importance. Traces of red pigment on the altar hint at the practice of sacrificial ceremonies. The possibility that the pyramid was conceived as one of the first Mesoamerican calendars, allowing for the observation of the spring equinox sunrise behind the Papayo volcano, further underscores its astronomical significance. The association of the pyramid with a fire god potentially linked to the nearby volcanic activity, is also evident. A ceramic figurine of an old man carrying a brazier, discovered near the altar, may point to fire-related rituals conducted at this sacred site. Near the pyramid, archaeologists discovered a structure referred to as a kiva, adorned with abstract geometric shapes and red ochre paintings, some of the oldest of their kind in Mesoamerica. Its purpose remains debated, with possibilities ranging from an astronomical observatory 
to a ceremonial altar or even a temazcal, steam bath. The circular form itself may have symbolized the caves central to many Mesoamerican creation myths. The pyramid's construction underwent multiple phases, starting with two levels and a temple on top, later expanded with two additional levels, reflecting its enduring importance and evolving function over time. Life in ancient Cuicuilco was deeply intertwined with the surrounding environment. Agriculture, with maize as the staple crop, formed the backbone of their economy. The sophisticated hydraulic system not only supported agriculture, but also provided water for daily life and religious practices. The proximity of the Zitla volcano likely played a significant role in shaping their worldview and influencing their ritual practices, perhaps as a way to mediate the powerful forces of nature. Evidence suggests a hierarchical society with a ruling elite who likely oversaw governance and religious ceremonies. Religious practices were an integral part of their lives, as evidenced by stone offerings, ceramics found in burial sites, and the rituals conducted at the main pyramid. The discovery of pottery reflecting deities and religious symbolism further underscores the importance of their belief system. Quiquilco was not an isolated entity. Archaeological findings reveal cultural connections and influences from other Mesoamerican groups, including the Olmecs, as seen in early pottery styles. Later, the city interacted with the rising power of Teotihuacan, demonstrating its place within a broader regional network. The circular form of the pyramid even bears similarities to later architectural styles found in Huastec and Tarascan cultures, suggesting a potential legacy or shared traditions. The flourishing city of Cuicilco met an abrupt end due to violent eruptions of the Zitla volcano. While the exact timing is debated, it's generally thought to have occurred between 245 and 315 CE. Lava flows buried Quiquilco and the surrounding area under thick layers of rock, forcing inhabitants to flee and abandoning the once thriving city. This volcanic destruction, similar in scale to Pompeii's fate, drastically altered the landscape. Displaced Quiquilco people likely migrated to other settlements in the Valley of Mexico, notably Teotihuacan, which rose to prominence after Cuicuilco's demise. Cuicuilco's rediscovery began in the early 1900s with major excavations between 1922 and 1925, led by Byron Cummings, who used explosives to reveal the round pyramid top. Eduardo Noguera opened the site to the public in 1939, promoting further research. Later excavations, especially in the 1960s, uncovered artifacts indicating continued occupation after volcanic eruptions. However, full excavation is challenging due to lava cover and urban development, with the 1968 Olympic Village construction causing further damage. Quiquilco, with its circular pyramid, was a complex urban center with multiple pyramids, terraces, and temples. The main pyramid, Great Base, had a semicircular shape with ramps and oval altars. Other structures included the Kiva, structure E1, and a stella with engravings. Residential areas, plazas, and a hydraulic system were also present. Artifacts such as pottery, sculptures, and everyday items reveal Cuicuilco's culture, connections, and daily life. Cuicuilco, an early major urban and ceremonial center in the Valley of Mexico, predates Teotihuacan and may have influenced its development. Its unique circular pyramid is one of the earliest monumental structures in the region, potentially inspiring later pyramids. The city's history, especially its relationship with Teotihuacan, offers insights into the pre-classic period's power dynamics and cultural transformations.